Yo guys, how is it going? I hope everyone is doing well and having a fantastic day. Welcome back to our Brighton career mode here on FC24. This is episode 14 of season 2. And today we start with an FA Cup game away at Derby and then we're away at Leicester in the Premier League. This season, it's been very up and down with results. But performances have been pretty good in, I'd say, nearly every game. Our only problem has been scoring goals. We have the worst attack in the league, scoring just 17. But we have the best defence, conceding 19. So if we had more goals in the team this season, I'd say we'd be... 5th, 6th, maybe even 4th, we would be in that kind of area. So we're having a similar sort of season as last in the league and we're still in the FA Cup. Derby stand in our way. Last season we got to the final and lost to Liverpool. So let's do our best to knock Derby out of the FA Cup and keep our dream alive of going to Wembley and lifting the FA Cup. It's a very good pass. Now Bird. And he's found a teammate, Collins. Now Thompson. Slices wide. And it's still goalless. But a very good start to the game from Derby. But yeah, I'm very confident we are going to get through to round five. Now Garcia. Hudson Adoy, Garcia again. It's a brilliant one, two. Garcia, what a save! Oh, that should have been a goal. And Garcia scoring on his debut within 11 minutes. Corner Brighton, and it's a fantastic cross. Garcia, header goes over. What a leap. I'm not sure if I showed you guys his attributes. He's an absolute beast. Physically incredible. 88 acceleration, sprint speed 89, jumping 95. Stamina is good, strength 87. He's good on the ball. Finishing is 79, heading accuracy 83. So, yeah, a brilliant signing. And to be honest, I think he's going to score us a lot of goals. I think I said that about Cameron Archer as well, and I think he scored one or two. So, hopefully I haven't jinxed it. <laughs> hudson Adoy, De Hood again. Into Kone. The last ten minutes or so, it's been all Brighton. And surely that first goal is going to come very soon. Kone! Oh my god, superb stop. How has it stayed out? It was very close to him, but brilliant reactions. What a save. And it's another corner, Joa Pedro. Brilliant again from the goalie. It was a great headed effort from Joa Pedro going straight in that top corner. Was it goalkeeper then crossbar? I think it was. Yep. 
Yeah. Fantastic save. Onto the crossbar. Wow. And the attack isn't over just yet. It's another corner. Joa Pedro. Another save. And here we come again. Garcia just about finds a teammate. And it's a brilliant back heel. Cardona. Decent header. And the attack is still alive. Now Alonso. 26 minutes gone. Can we score that first goal? It's a decent cross. Not a great header. De Hood. 1 0 Brighton. After 27 minutes. And it's fully deserved. That header from the Derby defender at the far post was woeful. It's a great assist. <laughs> but that header was lovely from De Hood. Just looped it over the goalkeeper into that far corner. And we lead in the FA Cup against Derby. That's a great tackle from Chavez. Now Joa Pedro and it's a brilliant run. Joa Pedro, what a stop. From Wildsmith. He's keeping them in this match, he really is. 31 minutes gone, can we make it 2-0? Is the attack over? It is. And that's a brilliant pass. And Bird is through. Bird! Off the crossbar. Or was it the post? I think it was the post. Or near enough right on the corner. Yeah, right on the corner. Where the crossbar and post meet. Wow. Nearly found that top corner. But it's still 1-0 to Brighton. Now Garcia. And it's a fantastic run. Can he make it 2-0 to put us in control? I should have passed it. I've done just a little bit too much. I've played with Garcia just for 42 minutes and I have the same feeling I did when I done the Spurs career I have the same feeling with Garcia as I did with Rich Arlison when he has possession I don't feel like anyone can take it away from him I think he's going to score us so many goals I really do Oh, that's a lovely back heel. Now Kone. Easy save. And that's not a great throw. Now Garcia. Oh, off both posts. And it's 2-0 Brighton. And he scored on his debut. Seconds after me saying, I really do think he's going to score a lot of goals for us. Off the right post, then the left, then the back of the net. And we're in control against Derby in the FA Cup. There's the half-time whistle. We lead by two at the break. And surely... We are going to get through to round five in the FA Cup. Now Bird, Washington, into Collins, and it's a brilliant run, what a save. He done really well to get past one, but Rui Silva in the way. 
And it's still 2-0 Brighton. And that's a good tackle. They had a good start to the first half. And they've had a good start to the second. And it's a free kick in a really good area. It's a good chance to grab a goal back. Are they going to make it 2-1? Poor effort. And we still lead by two, but so far this second half, Derby have been the better team. Now Alonso into Garcia. Can we make it 3-0? And game over. It's a decent cross. Keeper does well. And we do have it back immediately. And Garcia is through. Game over. And Garcia is on a hat-trick on his debut with 20 minutes to go. And that's our first shot in this second 45 minutes. Derby, in this second half, have been the better side. But Garcia at the double to put us firmly in control and surely there's no way back for Derby. We're heading through to round five in the FA Cup after a 3-0 victory against Derby and it was deserved. Derby had a few good spells in this match but overall we were the better team and could have easily scored another three or four goals. And Garcia Scored two on his debut. So far so good from the striker. Let's just hope he can score like this in the Premier League. To solve our problems at the moment. Which of course is scoring goals. We've only scored 17 in the Premier League. Which is the worst attack in the league. So yeah fingers crossed he can be consistent in front of goal for us. And like I just said. So far, so good. Full-time result here. Derby nil, Brighton 3. Garcia, Hudson Adoy, now Garcia, and this brilliant play from the striker, Garcia, what a save, six minutes gone, and it's the first corner of the game, and it's not a bad delivery, keeper catches, and it's still goalless, now Saar, Oh, Leicester going to score the first goal in this match. Saw so, what a save. And the attack is over. That should have been 1-0 Leicester. Now Garcia into hudson Adoy, And we still have it, but not for long. Chalaba does well. Now Bellotti, who is Leicester's top scorer with eight goals. So, yeah, going to be a big threat up top. So let's hope he doesn't have any chances or many chances in this match. And it's a fantastic run here from Raquel May. 24 minutes gone. Can we score that first goal in this match? Now Hudson Adoy, very good save, and it's our second corner in this match. Chavez, sorry Raquel May with the effort, and it was a good save, and it's another corner. Can we score that first goal? Header goes over. Keeper wasn't needed that time. Just a little bit lower, and I think that was 1-0. 
I'm not sure the keeper had it covered. But still goalless after 26 minutes. But so far, we have been the better team. So I'm confident that first goal will come very soon. Now Dewsbury Hall, and it's a fantastic run. Dewsbury Hall slices wide. And we're still looking for that first goal. Leicester's last five matches, one loss, two wins and two draws. So they're bottom, but not on a bad little run. And that loss was 6-0 away at Manchester United. But yeah, I'm confident we are going to get all three points. Now Garcia, hudson Adoy. can he get past one? Yes he can, but not a second. And that's a great tackle from Lamptey, Garcia, now hudson Adoy. lovely one too, but he's offside. Oh, wow. That is so close. And that's a brilliant header from Dunk. Hudson Adoy. Now Garcia. And it's a fantastic run. Can he score the first goal? No, he can't. Keeper denies him. Chavez. Sanchez. Garcia. Raquel May. Now Garcia. This is decent play. Can we score that first goal? Very good save. Oh my god. That was a dangerous pass. And it's still goalless. But for how long? If the chances keep coming, surely that first goal will go in eventually. Now Lamptey into Chavez, Sanchez, Garcia, Raquel May. Now Sanchez, Lamptey, can he find a Brighton player? Garcia! Straight at the keeper. I don't know why I shot. I should have crossed it. It was a very tight angle. Fifty-six minutes gone, and somehow we still haven't scored. And here they come. Now all Brighton, and it's a lovely cross. One nil Leicester. I can't believe it. They've made it 1-0 against the run of play. Oh, that's so frustrating. It's a brilliant delivery from Albrighton. And all he has to do is get it on target. Mavadidi with his fourth Premier League goal of the season. To put his side in front. Now Bellotti, Dewsbury Hall. Bellotti again. Bellotti. Referee brings it back. And it's a free kick to Leicester. In a very good position. Guedes. Off target. Ten to go. And the home side still lead by one. Now Klosterman. And it's a brilliant tackle from Joa Pedro. Can he make it 1 1? Oh, what a save! I should have squared it. I should have squared it. Now, Joa Pedro. Kone. Joa Pedro! 1 1. With two to go of the 90. Thank God. Seconds ago, I should have scored. 
I should have squared it for a tap in, but it was a fantastic save. And Joa Pedro gets a second go, and he makes no mistake. Bottom corner, and it's game on. Can we score again to get all three points, which is what we deserve? Three minutes have been added on, and here they come on the attack. It's a fantastic run here from Guedes. Goes over, and it's still 1-1. It's ended all square at 1-1, which I'm a little bit happy about and kind of frustrated about because... We were the much better team and should have got all three points pretty comfortably. But they took the lead totally against the run of play. And yeah, after going behind, I'm just happy we didn't lose. Full-time result here. Leicester won, Brighton won. So after a draw against Leicester, we're now in 11th place. Seven wins, eight draws and seven losses. So a similar sort of season as last, which is kind of frustrating because I did want to push a little bit higher in the table this season. It's still possible, but I don't think it's going to happen. Arsenal are top, Man City in second, Liverpool third, Man United in fourth. Arsenal and Man United have lost just once. In 22 matches, Man City lost twice, but seven draws. Look at Man United, 10 draws. Newcastle in fifth. The bottom three, Middlesbrough, Leicester and Wolves. 14 points, 14 points, 16, 18, 19 and 19. That bottom six, it's very, very tight. With quite some time to go. 22 games. Who do you think is going to go down? I know it's very early on to say that, but who do you think is going to get relegated? I think Middlesbrough, Sheffield United... And I'm going to go Forest. Those three are my picks to get relegated. And I think Arsenal are going to win the title. I mean, 17 wins in 22 games is absolutely brilliant with just one loss. So let me know who you think is going to get relegated and who's going to win the title. And where do you think we're going to finish? Mid-table? Top seven? Top six? Maybe even top five? It's definitely possible if we go on a good run. But I'm not quite sure that's going to happen, to be honest. But you never know. Next episode, we're at home to West Ham and then away at Arsenal. So that is going to wrap up today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a brilliant day. Peace.